I got kind of a list on my phone. I've been planning this for a little while. I've been wanting to do this for a while. So I'm just kind of sitting here by the river here in Chatham and it feels pretty good to finally get going on this. Now I'm probably, I'm not gonna cut anything. This is gonna be like uncut. And I think I used to do some of this stuff in my vlogs, but then the vlogs kind of became more of like highlights and lots of cuts and lots of this and that and edits. But this is, see I can't even speak that much. Blech, ADD, ADHD. This is gonna be more of just like sit down and talk and um, it's very raw, I guess. For the people who are into that, some people like the high pace, fast pace vlogs and I do too, I love that shit. But sometimes you just gotta sit down and talk, have a conversation. So, huh, first question I got here on this little list of questions is who am I? And I'm guessing if you clicked on this, you probably know who I am already. I'm just some guy, um, 25. I, um, I've been playing music since I was like 10 and I really identified with myself, identified myself with music for a long time. But I think in general, I'm just an artist. I just like to create things. I'll make videos, I'll make vlogs, I'll make podcasts, I'll, um, I'll make music videos, I'll make music, whatever. Um, actually recently, I, I dropped everything. I dropped all of it so that I could build a van for uh, my family. This is Zen the dog, German Shepherd. And um, my girlfriend Tina is at work. We live together in a van now. Pretty crazy to think. And we're doing this by choice, by the way. <laughs> I, I tell some people that we live in a van and they like feel bad. I told this one girl at, at the store once and she, <laughs> I said, yeah, we live in a van. She's like, oh, and I'm like, no, no, we chose this life. That's what we decided to do. But anyway, there's gonna be lots of getting um, off track, but I don't know oh, who I am. Answering that question is tough because at the same time, I don't know exactly completely who I am. I think I'm really still figuring that out. And I will probably always still be figuring that out. And part of this podcast, part of this vlog video, whatever you wanna call this, is discovering who I am and maybe putting my thoughts and my feelings and my perspectives on paper, not really paper, on video so that I can go back and reflect. But also, I feel like this will have value for other people too because for some reason, like, I, I it's tough for me sometimes to put myself on video, but in general, I'm, it's pretty easy for me to just be vulnerable, to just be an open book, to just tell you exactly how I feel, good or bad. And I know it's not always easy for everybody, so maybe somewhere out there, someone out there can relate to what I'm saying or how I'm feeling or just what I'm going through in life. And maybe not, maybe you have your own completely different perspective that I'd love to hear, because I'm always interested in everybody's perspectives. So throw some, some shit in the comments for me. I wanna connect, I actually wanna read some comments and and reply and have a little conversation. That's what this whole, um, this is what this is all about for me. Um, why am I doing this series podcast? That's the next question, but I think I basically already answered that for you. A million reasons. I actually did a podcast a couple years ago. I was on a podcast with my brother and uh, yeah, we kind of explored a lot of like personal development, psychology, um, society like all those kinds of topics and ideas but for this podcast it's going to be more personal i think it's be more focused on what i'm going through um me <laughs> maybe that's selfish uh, but like i said i think by doing that it's also you know putting myself on the line to get ridiculed i mean y'all could just like talk shit about me y'all could tear me down um, go ahead. I've had it happen to me many times in the past. Hateful comments, hateful people um, hating on me. Go ahead. I guess that's part of the life we chose here on the internet. Um, but yeah, I just want to kind of explore that. I'll probably have some guests on the show. Who knows, man? I love to sit down with people and just have conversations. It'd be cool to record that and to also share that um, with other people here. What am I going to do? Uh, <laughs> that's the next question. I don't know what I'm going to do actually, to be honest, that's how I've been feeling a lot lately. Ever since we kind of mostly finished our van project, I've been a little bit lost on like what to do next. Do I work on new music? Do I work on making vlogs? Do I start a podcast? I don't really know what I'm going to do. And I tend to think a lot. I think I said that at the beginning, I'll just think and think and think and think and think. So to kind of put my thoughts down, on a video will help me. And I think that's just what I'm gonna do. <laughs> I don't know. Let's see what's next here on my list of questions. 
Um, how's the van coming along? A lot of people have been asking, the van's coming along great. We're gonna be doing a van tour very soon. Uh, the van's always changing. I mean, we're in it and we're living in it, but it's not done and we're still changing things. We just ordered a, <laughs> get this, we just ordered a Keurig latte machine so that we can make lattes at home and stop going to Starbucks and shit. So uh, that's how it's coming along. How, when's new music coming out? I don't know, I'm working on it. It's gonna come out when it comes out. But um, I guess I've just been facing like a creativity block, just not feeling very creative and I gotta get over it, man. And so forcing myself to just like get out of my head and create, even if the creation that I'm creating is just the literal thoughts in my head that I'm trying to escape from, I, it could work out. Uh, let me answer one more question before I kind of just ramble. Um, when are you traveling? So as you know, we got this van and we're living in this van so that we could kind of just live anywhere and we could travel Canada, we want to see Canada, we want to see United States, we want to see Europe, we want to see the freaking world. Um, but we're young kids and we spent all of our money on the van, so now we don't really have much money to travel. So we're going to be hanging out in Chatham Kent for the summer, just working, earning some money so that we could um, afford to go on the road. And we're hoping that by the time the winter comes along, we'll have enough money saved up that we can just like travel for a few months, escape the Canadian winter and go and enjoy maybe California, something like that. Maybe uh, some of the southern states of the United States trying to take it easy, but all at the same time, you take it easy so much that you get to a point where you just gotta go, you gotta do something. And that's where I'm at now. I feel like after I finished the van, took it real easy, and now I'm bored. <laughs> and I'm sitting by the river talking to a camera. Um, the highs are high, but the lows are friggin' low. And if you can relate, then you know exactly what I'm talking about. And I've been kind of just bouncing between the high and the low. It's been really great. It's been amazing. And then it's also been freaking a roller coaster ride. So just going through that, trying to, trying to get out of my head. Man, I don't know if you can relate, but the thoughts just go and go and go. And I mean, I've been doing a few things recently that helped me to stop thinking. Um, one of them is the Wim Hof method. If you ever heard of Iceman Wim Hof, he's got this breathing technique. Uh, it feels amazing. I've been really experimenting with that lately. Going for more walks. Oh, Zen wants in on this. Oh, she's thirsty. Did you just burp? Oh my God, she just burped. Anyway, I'm gonna leave it at that. If you guys want to um, leave some comments, let me know what you're thinking. Let me know how you're feeling. Let me know your perspectives. Let me know, throw me some questions. Cause I'm thinking another thing that I might do here is just like answer answer questions <laughs> but not like a Q&A like random questions like what's your favorite color like I'm talking like deep shit I'm talking like I, I want to get deep into my mind into my psyche into my soul like I want to understand myself a lot and I think that's part of what all the thinking is the overthinking and the ADHD I think it's part of me just like being super curious but something about thinking uh, it's just like it doesn't ever stop but if I put I notice like when I'm doing a podcast if I just record it it can stop it can actually slow down and same thing with journaling if I just write it down then the thinking can stop and I could focus and so that's what this is gonna be about for me anyway I can just ramble on and on and on but I'm gonna let you go okay make sure you subscribe like leave a comment goodbye peace